Welcome everyone to Terrarian Adventures Season 3 Episode 10. If you guys didn't see the last episode, and the last episode was an actual, a, actually, a, it was a stream. So, we did a lot in that stream. We got Solar Flare, and we got some other stuff as well. So, we got the Star Wraith, I'm just playing, we got the Star Wrath. Uh, we still have the Terra Blade, but the Star Wrath is definitely better than most um so yeah with that we we pretty much got everything going we can go ahead so i do got the pill wait what wait 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 um wait just a minute there all right well that's uh, that might be a little bit of a difficult one so i do have some pillars up uh we're gonna go ahead and finish those I do got some of the, I got, I got some stuff here. So we're gonna go out and look around. Um, this is actually gonna be called the the end. The, the end, this actually might be close to the end or it might not be close to the end, we'll see. But we did get some stuff that we uh, that we haven't had, you know, and we're, we're there, you know, we're pretty much there. There's literally not much that we can do other than just make maybe the Zenith. We can probably make this uh, drill containment unit. We can probably do some other stuff. As of right now, we do not have the best wings. So I kind of want to just, I kind of want to make the best wings because sometimes you don't always want to use the mount. So wings are the best bet. So um, let's go ahead and start getting these, these done. With this, it should be no issue. Like literally, it should be no issue. We can go ahead and get some potions though, just in case. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, Probably just a couple of this, maybe a little bit of, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe a little bit of well-fed. We'll do major, I guess. We'll, we'll get the mango. We'll get some thorns, and, uh, we don't have any other potion other than that. I think these should be good enough, since I have the solar flare. Solar flare should help us with the, the battle here. Go to the nebula one, because I, I just want to get the nebula one done. It, it, oh man, you have no idea. So the nebula one is going to be the first, like I said, the first one. So uh, we're going to have to get some stuff going. These, so the Star Wrath does wonders. If I keep getting hit though, because I'm so used to an ultra wide screen to the point where I'm just like sitting there. I'm just like, uh-uh, I, I can't, can't do this. I'm going to die already. Wow, this is terrible. I thought I was good. I thought I was good to go. Apparently I'm not. Well, that's terrible. Ah, <sighs> man, I dropped 16 gold. I'm gonna have to, all right, all right. Now it's something different. We're gonna have to go get that back. There's a possibility. Okay, so I know, I know what I can do. We can take out the piggy. Quick stack. There you go. Got my gold back. All right, you wanna stop shooting me, you brailian? What the hell are you doing? All right, this is not, this is not, come on, we should just be, we should be acquaintances, all right? All right, this is just, this is so crude. All right, shooting your freaking lasers at me. Well, I just came over here. I know you're protecting your weird pillar. You don't have to protect your real pillar. I'm not here, I'm not here to, okay, you need to go. You need to go, whoever's shooting me with the damn, all right, don't let those guys get up on top of your head. That, you don't, you don't want that. We're gonna get some fragments over here. So, with the fragments, we can do some other stuff as well. So, yeah, we're gonna need to fight the, the Moon Lord again. But, it's good because I can fight the Moon Lord in this video. We can show it. Alright, so this, this star, okay, so the Star Wrath does so good for killing the pillars. It does so good. I'm not gonna lie. It's great. Alright, you guys need to stop spawning in here. Alright, I've already killed your pillar. Time for you to go. All right. I don't care what you're gonna do there. Where did the the nurse go? Is the nurse back in her spot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Thank you for the eleven gold. You you, you like the corruption? No, that's why you charged me eleven gold. Thank you so much. I don't care if the corruption is around you. Uh, I only don't care because this world is done for. So yeah, there's corruption everywhere in this world. So. Uh, next time if I do any other series, uh, so this Terraria is probably gonna go away for a little bit So here, here's what I want to do. Terraria is gonna go away for a little bit because I want to gain another I want to gain a different type of audience audience as well as a Terraria audience as well I want to I want to get gain a different audience with different types of video games So I thought it would be a great opportunity to do so with different games So Terraria is gonna take a, a Terraria, you can take a little bit of a break. 
All right, we better, we better kill this thing before these things just kill me. So we'll heal up. It's already dead. There you go. There you go. Thank you for letting me fly. We'll go ahead and just use that. Okay, cool. All right. Overworldly voices linger around you. So I do want to. I do have some ideas for games. I was gonna record a free random games to keep Trey a little bit down, but this is this is the ending. So I was gonna, you know, record for 30 minutes, and I, I think I'm gonna do a little bit more than probably 30 minutes, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But there's not a lot to do other than just do this, do stuff with the Moon Lord. There's probably some other stuff that we can do as well. Trade adventures might be modded, so if we can, we'll probably take this this character into a different world, and we'll mod it. Same character. The reason why the same character is because mods are di mods are different. Or if you guys would like, I can make a new play playthrough with Terraria mods. It would be it would make it a little bit different. So just let me know down in the comments below if you want to see any of that. Right now we're just, we just gotta we just gotta get these these out of here, and uh, we'll heal up and stuff. So so I think the pillar is broken. I already did the solar flare one, I believe, in the in the stream. All right, so. Yeah, it's down there. I, don't, I think it's in the corruption area. Oh, yeah, it's right here. <laughs> I wonder why. So I guess we'll just use my... We'll use this. Well, this game is... If you guys are... Okay, so th this world is old. I made it in 2019, I believe. Way before 1.4.4 or any, any of the any of the new updates. It, that's why I'm thinking we should just create a new world. And we can put this old Terraria Adventures world to rest. It's been... It's been a, a sweet... It's been a sweet ride, you know, I mean, I think I started Terraria Avengers in 2017. So it's been a long while since I've I've done anything with this series. One time I haven't made it for, I haven't did anything with it for a year. And another, another time I was just like, you want to know it? Let's continue with it. Let's do what we can do with it and let's get it done. But yeah, it's been a thing for 2017. So I, I kind of think we should... We should uh, start a new world. Maybe add some mods. I'll, I'll learn how to, you know, I'll probably add some mods to it. We'll do some pretty cool mods. I'm thinking that I need to get into mods because Minecraft mods was a big thing for me. So I think Terraria is now the thing I need to learn how to mod. So once that happens, maybe I'll start doing that. The, the base game of Terraria is just, there's so much in the game that you can do. Or if we want to do a master mode world, we can do that. But that's... I mean, we, we've seen all that stuff before. We've seen all me dying all the time and stuff. We really don't need that. We'll grab the Stardust Wings and then we'll we'll probably heal up from the Nurse first before in, uh, the Pending Doom. So I'm going to heal up from the Nurse real quick because we need to hurry up. I don't really use a Sky thing. All I use is potions and stuff. So I, I, try, I try to stay by it for the Cozy Fire. But other than that, it's not really needed for me. I'll just quick buff and we'll get this party started. We'll see if we can get the um, the Meowmer because that'd be nice. Or some some other stuff. Be pretty cool. Be pretty sweet. Be pretty great. So yeah, let's see if we can get the Meowmer. I don't really want the Prismarine. Uh man, I don't like the uh, the mana weapons. But watch me get the Prismarine now. The that I said it. So here we go. First Moon Lord boss fight. Uh oh, Star Fury, Star Wrath is not doing anything. I don't know why I can't hit the moon. I cannot hit this dude with the Star Fury. It's just not doing great. Oh, okay, this is probably why. There you go. All right, let me just, let me just, let me just terrorblade this. Oh, that's why. I think I, I think I use this. This is like the best thing to use. All right, all right, we, we gotta get you out of here, buddy. I'm sorry. But you are the main thing I gotta get. And I think the Star Fury would be the best thing for the, the, the top eye. So we're gonna use this for the side eyes. The This really does kind of work really well. Um, let me heal up a bit. Come on, come on, come on. There you go, there you go. It was like the 50th time I did this so far. That It's not that, it's okay, so it's not that difficult. I've done this before many different times. So let's go, let's go, let's go. There we go. We're gonna get it, we're gonna get it, we're gonna get it. Yeah, this is it. This okay. Yeah, we're, we're gonna, I'm not even worried about it. <laughs> oh, wait, well, look at that—a sky island that's gonna kill me. There you go. Oh, the Moon Lord is so sad. Oh, that, that I seen what we got. We got this beautiful thing here. Nice. Oh, we got this though. This. Oh, I love this thing. Hell yeah. Well, that was a productive Moon Lord experience right there. I must say. So we can get to crafting. 
we can definitely get the crafting. So if I go to souls and fragments, I only have 14 of those. Oh, well. oh that's why I have it, because I only have uh, the thing. So what I'm going to do, so I'm going to go ahead and make, we're going to make some luminite bars. I'm going to go with the stardust wings this time. They're the best, they're the, they're the best wings in the game. I don't know if I can make them though. I can. It takes 10. I'll have eight, so, ooh, nebula wings. But the stardust wings are the best. Goodbye, specter wings. You served us well. You served us well. You helped us get rid of the, uh, the terrible, terrible angel wings. And now we got the probably the best wings in the game. Way better than any wings I've ever had. See, that's the thing. Sometimes you just don't want to use them out all the time. It's just, it's just how it goes. It's just how it rolls. Sometimes you just don't want to do that. All right, so what we can do, we can farm the, we can farm the Moon Lord a couple of times, okay, if we have to. There's a Moon Lord thing right here. I have the Celestial Sigil, so I might want to make a couple of those. All right, well, I guess we can always just do the pillars again. They're not that hard, but I am going to go ahead and do the uh, Moon Lord again, because I do have a Sigil, so just for the hell of it. Also, I have a Corruption Key, which I probably don't have anymore I don't, I don't need any of the banners but i'm gonna go ahead and use these with for something these are pretty cool this is just gonna be me farming the uh, moon lord see what i can get maybe i'll uh get the zenith maybe maybe i'll get the zenith in this episode oh my god i forgot the quick buff bro i swear it's when his eye his hands bro it's when his hands go outwards his hands go outwards and stuff and my stars can't touch his eyes so the star fury is like probably the worst weapon you can use you have to stay still for the star fury to work well which is not ideal for the moon lord yeah i might i might i actually might die for the, with this battle what oh yeah i did i died and i dropped a platinum <laughs> so yeah i don't know why i died on that one i can go to map figure out where i died it's over here so there you go how much platinum i have six platinum how did that? How did, how did, did, did Okay, anyways. I don't think I'm gonna need anything for the plant terror. Can you stop opening it? Plant terror. So I'm gonna go ahead. We're gonna find some plant terrors and I'm gonna. I'm just gonna farm some plant terrors. I gotta get the seedler. We're gonna make the zenith in, the, in this day. In this episode. I gotta make the zenith. Just almost. It was almost. Similar to when I said I had terror blade. Similar to that. I was like, I, I gotta make the zenith now. So. Um, if I can go ahead and figure out where plant terra bulbs are, I'm just like come at me. So I got this, which also did drop from the the thing. Whoa, no way! That does more damage than the freaking sword. Also, let's get this. Let's get that started. Wow, already doing a lot of damage to the freaking plant terra, dude. Plant terra, I just, I don't, I don't. Wow, terrible. I did not get the seedler though, so I really don't need any of this though. Yeah, right, right here, right here. There you go. Ooh, wow. Everyone's like saying to use the Uzi on the Plantera when you start. Damn. This is, this is, these, these are the weapons. And especially that thing is helping me. I did not get the Seedler, but I got that. Wow. Just the sheer speed of, and we got it. We got the pointy Seedler. Yes. There we go. Just like that. We got the gun that we, or gun? The sword, got the sword we needed. And that's just how you do it. All right, so I wanna check something out here. If I go to crafting, I go and I get put the seedler in here. We need, and I quote, this many swords. So we need the enchanted sword and I, do not, I don't think I have a, an enchanted sword in this, in this. I don't know if the enchanted sword is craftable or not. But uh, if it is, maybe we can craft it. But if we can't, we'll go into a different world and find it. Because I know I don't. I know I don't have one in this world. But I never look, so maybe I do have an enchanted sword thing in here. We'll take a look. Uh, the rainbow ice staff. I for. I don't really like that one. I'm. Pr I don't know. We'll put it away. And that has no valuable value. It's not valuable, but you can have it. It's yours to keep for free. All right. So. I'm gonna go to weapons and then put some weapons away. Um, okay, I think I have a weapons too. We're gonna put the crafting recipe for the Zenith here. I think I have the, oh, I have a, oh, I didn't even know I had this. Okay, okay. 
How would I make the copper short sword, though? That's the question. I don't know how much copper I'm going to need. Uh-oh. We'll go ahead and just stick them right here. We do have the Star Wrath, but we're going to keep that inside my uh, my inventory. And I we need the Terrible to have it. We need the Meow Mare to have it. Whoa, so you're telling me my Meow... Oh, wait. Okay, we so we have... Okay, so Meow, Mare is, Meow Mare is way better than the, the, the Star Wrath. Uh, okay, so so we need the Influx Waiver, and I don't have that. The Horseman's Blade... Uh, the Star Fury, which I think we do have. I have the Beekeeper. Okay, so we need the Enchanted Sword, the Horseman. Okay, so we just need a few swords. We just need a few swords. Okay, so I'm going to figure out how to get all these because that's one thing. I think the Horseman Swords come from one of the Pumpkin Moons, which should be easy to get. Play you in weapons too. I like the, I like the uh, SDMG, but um, something I don't see myself really using. I'll probably just use mostly these and yeah, so We already got one two three four five So what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna start looking for the the enchanted sword I probably can find find it. They say uh, it's at the edge of the world But I I have no idea if it actually is or not So I went to a different world and we found an enchanted sword shrine just wanted to make sure you guys seen that uh, never mind. I did not get- uh, that took me so long to find. No way. Two now. We're going to see if this is a correct one. I made another world. This one should be it. Oh my god, that took me so long. I'm so dead, dude. Now that we're back in the other world, we can go ahead and sell a couple things to the zoologist here. I'll give you each one of these. You can have you can have everything. Just 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 take everything. It came from the other worlds. It's whatever. Just don't sell the don't just don't sell the uh the the the, the, so, the sword. Yeah, don't sell that. We need that. That was the hardest sword to get. Now we just need to go ahead and spawn an alien invasion, which should be pretty easy. I have a little thing somewhere. We need the thing from the alien invasion, and then we're going to need to fight the moon lord a couple times. I'll go ahead and probably do that. All right, we got our little thing here. Oh, jeez. Wow, that was easy. Now we, we need to get the influx, the influx thing. We don't get the influx thing. We're just going to have to, just going to have to try to get it. Again, we'll have to farm this out. So the reason why I'm trying to get this, get this, get this, and I'm really taking my time to get this, is I've never once made the zenith in Terraria ever. Actually, this is actually something I've never done before. Okay, we need we, this thing. Needs to actually come out here and help me. I was in Xeno Staff. We have another, we have another flying saucer here. Let's hope it comes back up here. There you go. Yeah, the yo-yo is the best one. And we got the influx waiver. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Okay, so at this point, we can just get some extra stuff, sell it. There you go. There you go. Yeah, got a lot of stuff. Uh, before, I don't, I don't want to accidentally sell anything. So we're going to put the stuff. All we have left is honestly the ho the horseman's thing. I'm going to figure out how to get that. I think I need to get the pumpkin moon. If that's the case, we're going to have to somehow get pumpkins. I don't know if I have pumpkins, but if I do, oh boy, oh boy. We'll see, we'll, we'll see, because I do have pumpkin pies, so maybe I used, accidentally used all my pumpkin. Well, all right, let's see what stacks and what doesn't. There you go. And we can also put this in the crafting recipes. Because, oh, and uh, we only need two more, so I think the the longest one that I'm that's going to take is uh, the Meow Mare, because the Moon Lord is probably not going to want to give me what I need. If that's the case, we're just going to go ahead and sell it to this guy. You can have the car key... You can pretty much have it. Every, 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 well, I kind of want one of those. You have everything uh, I have here, except for the these. This is a little, a really nice trophy. I want. I'm just gonna hang it up right here. There you go. And then we're gonna put the key here, because I don't know if I have a desert one, and I'm not worried about the desert one right now. But I am worried about the pumpkin moon. I need 30 pumpkin and 30 hollowed bars. I don't know if I have hollowed bars. Thing. So I have nine hollowed bars. Uh, this is actually going to be an easy thing to, uh, to do. I just got to wait until nighttime. So as I'm looking for pumpkin. All right. So I'm an idiot and I figured out that you can purchase pumpkin seeds from the dryad, but I'm not sure if the dryad's going to. Yeah. Ha ha ha. That was funny. I'm sitting there trying to figure out how to get pumpkin. All I know is that pumpkin does ma uh, naturally grow in the thing. So I might have to go a little bit AFK for this because I. 
do not know how long it's going to take. <sighs> so, change of plans. I did wait a little bit. Uh, we're going to go ahead and fight the destroyer twice as we're waiting for the plumpkins. So, here we go. We're going to go ahead and do that right now without any, any you know, thing. We, re we really don't need it. This is gonna be, this is gonna be okay. Actually, what I should do is I should bring it up, I should bring it up here. This is literally gonna take nothing. <laughs> I can do this a couple times if I needed to. Anyways, we just need the 30, the 30, uh, that was 19 hollowed bars. That's pretty good. And we do it again. I, I definitely could probably make more. I, anyways, 39, that's enough. Uh, the pumpkins are growing. Slowly but surely and okay, so we should just put those away. We're gonna cuz we're gonna need some of that. I should fight the twins again. I Know I can I know I can twins are probably not gonna be that difficult either. So yeah mechanical eye We can probably make two of them. Oh, 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 oh terrible 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 terrible. Oh my god uh, Okay, what am I doing? I'm all thinking I'm all going like crazy. I'm like, oh, oh, no. Oh, no I'm gonna die. And it's just like that thing just this right here it destroys it. We are gonna need to defeat the uh, Moon Lord a couple times again, though, which is the thing. But we're we're really close to the zenith, and I just don't I just really don't want to give up right now. And we can summon the Pumpkin Moon that I think needs to be summoned in the uh, in the nighttime. So I don't know. Well, I'll make I'll, I'll make sure before I do anything. So before I make anything, I'm gonna I'm just gonna make sure that it, if it has to be summoned during the night. We're gonna summon it right now once we make it. I'm probably not gonna have no time to have that thing summoned in and I'm probably gonna have no time But I can always get the pumpkins back because I have enough of the stuff It seems like I'm making the thing. I'm like I say it's so difficult But this thing is helping me so much. It's just so difficult to keep track on like what's spawning and what's not spawning I don't know if I have uh, a bewitched table, but I think I should go get one. Oh sheesh all right, all right, now it's getting a little bit difficult. I would like that pumpkin thing to spawn in, and I think it just did. Or if that's morning wood. That's morning wood. Yeah, that's that's something you don't want to say every day. Oh, that's morning wood. Yep, yeah, sure. That's just, just how it goes. Please, let me, let me have one of those things that would probably give me the pumpkin sword. I need the pumpkin sword. A solar eclipse? Oh, hell no. There's a bit of witching table down here somewhere. Just below me, and then when, after we get it, we can leave. So that means I can make I can make the Stardust Dragon a lot stronger with it, which is a lot better actually. Here, how about you die? I like how I can just sit here and do nothing. Well, both the Stardust Dragon, Lunar Portal Staff, can just do everything for me. It's insane. It's amazing. I'm gonna keep all this stuff in my inventory. We're just gonna go ahead and summon the pumpkin moon already. I want some help with the little thing over here. So we only, so after this, all we need really to do is to try to get as much as fragments as I can and beat the moon lord a couple times to see if I can get the meowmer. And we should be good to go with, with that. All right, so I hope I get some stuff from this, I think. That, that sword drops from that thing, by the way, if you guys are wondering. It drops from this thing, so I think I have a chance of getting it. I like how you just arise from the ground. Freaking morning wood rising, right? Uh, I don't know man, it's not looking good. 
Definitely not looking good. Oh, okay. We need to, we need to, we need to come up because I really, yes, yes, that was it. That was literally the, the sword that I needed. Definitely right on time too. And another solar eclipse is happening. I wish I can end the solar eclipse. So I went AFK throughout that whole solar eclipse because I wasn't dealing with it. And then, oh my God, that was, that was actually insane. All this stuff right here is insane. I'm not sure if anybody died. Let's go to the dungeon now and fight the lunatic cult cultists. As I said, this is gonna be easy. There was literally nothing hard about that. Uh, we might as well do this, this one first. So this thing is actually gonna help us with the pillars. I, I, I feel like I, I feel like I'm getting hurt, but I don't think I actually am. And more meteorites are landed. What a great, what a great thing that that is happening. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well you can still die. Uh, anyways, give me all the fragments. Well, we got this one done. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and. We're gonna we're gonna get all these done as quickly as possible. So this is Stardust one. This is the one that we actually have issues with making the other thing. So since I made the other thing, we'll just make a whole bunch of uh, Star Moon Lord summons. So just in case we don't get it, we can always get it later on. All right, let me go get some potions and sell some stuff as well. So we're gonna go ahead and put some stuff away. That's why I I was I wasn't gonna do I wasn't gonna uh, do anything with the Moon Lord this. Uh, this episode, but I realized that some of this stuff just is, is it's quick, so that was not a lot of solar fragments, but I will take oh, it was, it was almost 30 alright, let me just go ahead quick stack oh, I accidentally quick stack some potions that ain't good let's go ahead and use this because this seems like a really good yo-yo to use, actually oh man, oh man come on, you can't can't be doing that. This is a great yo-yo. Oh my god. No way. No way. If we get the Terrorblade right or the Yamir right away, that's gonna be OP. But we still we still didn't get the Prismarine, so I'm just saying. Go ahead heal up again. We'll use the nurse again once again. If I have to fight him again once again. Fight him again once again. And we don't have to fight him again once again because we got <laughs> the Meow Mare. All right. I think we're missing a, a, a oh, we might be missing a sword. I'm, I'm just, we need, we need to see if we're missing a sword. Ah, oh, the Star Fury. So I don't have the Star Fury, but do I have any? I do have floating islands. So we found some floating islands over here. So let's go take a look, find the Star Fury. All right, we got another chance. We'll see what's up. Got the Star Fury. And we got the last thing. And this is what the moment we've all been waiting for. <sighs> this is the moment we've all been waiting for. The copper, the lead broadsword. It is one of the best swords in the game. And we have finally made the zenith. Oh yes, this is the first time I made the zenith. You bet, you bet. This is awesome. So before we go, we are going to try it on, 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 a, on a boss. I want to try it at least on, on one boss. So we can bring these back. And we can add one more. And I'm just going to... So for this, I'm just going to grab a, a, a iron skin. This, should, this, shouldn't, this shouldn't be that, that hard. So... What? No way that does... Uh, wow. The most OP sword in, in the game. Wow, this is definitely, this is it. This is, this has definitely been probably one of the most productive episodes ever. Good way to end it, but I don't know if I want to end it. I don't really know. From something that I started in 2017, kind of put uh, put back because I, I just didn't play it or just didn't do anything with it. It surely is, is, is something interesting. Maybe I'll make the drill containment unit. If you guys want to see the drill containment unit, you got, let me know. And then we'll make an episode making the drill containment unit. I might... This is this is the finale, though. So this this series is going to slow down. And I'm sorry if, it's, if it hurts. But I know you guys like uh, Terraria a lot. 
with un- under two hours, we made one of the best swords in the game. And I'll try this out on some bosses and stuff. This is awesome. I can't. The Zenith is just so cool. I like it. So, with that being said, everyone, that's the end of the video. This has been a great Terraria experience. And if you guys want to see more Terraria on the channel, just let me know down in the comments below. Leave the video a like. And I will make whatever whatever Terraria videos I can come up with. I'm thinking about making a new playthrough that's modded. I was thinking about doing that. We'll see if it works. Maybe we can do the little thing. I don't know if they have any RPG mods with different with different npcs on this game if they do maybe i will i will do something that has to do with that but i've played this game so much on this channel to the point where we've seen all this stuff we've seen getting into hard mode we've seen getting in uh getting all this stuff and we've seen all the expert modes and stuff like that i played my own extra mode on by myself but that's just that's just how it is so i will figure it out but this series, the Trade Adventures, is going to slow down as of now. Uh, it's not going to be made a lot because we got what we needed. We got the Zenith. We beat the Moon Lord over 10 times at least. I did it a lot in the stream and I did a lot in this episode today. There's just been a lot going on and it is, it's coming to an end. So with that being said, everyone... Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for uh, keeping with this series. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.